Ghanaian team to the World Relays Championships in Bahamas has intensified its training ahead of the sprinting extravaganza that is set to bring together the best sprinters in the world. The team has been in residential training at the Kasarani Stadium. The team that will represent Kenya at the second edition of the World Relays Championships is a mix of experienced sprinters as well as athletes who will be competing in their first international assignment. After a week of residential training camp at the Kasarani Stadium, sprint coach Stephen Moneki says the athletes have managed to blend to near perfection ahead of the World Relays. Really, is you have to bond these athletes together so that they can uh, run together, can think together, sleep together, and uh, talk together. And that is what we are, we are trying to achieve. And uh, at least for, for the last one week, you can see the bonding is taking place. And uh, hopefully they will uh, be able to run together. What we are trying to do is uh, we are trying to synchronize the button uh, handling. And that is very crucial. Focus is currently on the technical aspects like the button handling as well as how to seamlessly get off the blocks. First times, however, remain a priority. Uh, the workout was, went well and uh, at least I uh, was able to achieve what I wanted to achieve this morning. And uh, I'm happy and we, hopefully things will turn around. Sylvia Tasebe is among the athletes who will be making an appearance at the World Relays Championships for the second time. Chesebe was part of the 4 by 800 meters team that bagged the silver at the World Relays Championships last year. All the top eight teams at the World Relays Championships in Bahamas will automatically qualify for the World Athletics Championships in Beijing, China. And it's for that reason that Kenyan athletes have their eyes set on qualifying for the finals. Lin Washira, KTN.